Welcome back on Gaming, this is Devin, and HBO Max just released a teaser trailer, I guess, of all their TV shows, movies, and that that are coming out. Uh, one of the ones that they did show in that trailer is The Last of Us TV show on HBO, which I don't believe we've seen any actual footage of it, so it was pretty cool seeing that. Uh, before we begin, I do just want to say that... Uh, just my background, I guess, with The Last of Us, or just my opinion of The Last of Us is I'm not, of course, the biggest fan of Last of Us Part 2, if you've seen any of my other videos. Uh, the Last of Us Part 1, I, I liked it. I don't think it was a, the best game ever. I don't think it was a 10 out of 10 in that. Uh, I did like a lot of parts of it, but just the game itself, I do not think it was a, the best game ever. Um, with that being said, <laughs> let's go ahead and uh, look into the TV show. So, uh, one of the first things that they show in this TV show is the snow, which I do believe is probably going to be right before uh, Ellie gets split off and, you know, uh, maybe when she meets David and that. So that'll be an interesting scene to see how they do that. Uh, I mean, if they do the TV show 100% of what the, the game is, uh, which... Uh, I, I, I'm not really interested in that part, but uh, then the next part that we see here is we see uh, Joel trying to teach Ellie how to shoot a gun or how to hold a gun, um, and of course this part was from the game as well. Then we go here to the uh, beginning of the game where Joel is with Sarah trying to get her out of the... Uh, I don't know, first infected part or the city uh, town part of it here. So uh, this should be a really interesting scene just because this was my favorite part, of course, of the the game itself is that it just started off with a bang. And this will be a very interesting part to see if they can actually pull this off on the TV show just because that sort of thing that hooks you into The Last of Us, it's the most emotional part, The you know, just... Like, man, we're going here already. So uh, let's, you know, see if they can actually pull it off in the, the TV show here. And then um, then we have the scene, of course, with Joel and Ellie where they are starting to connect uh, I, a little bit. Uh, I remember from a little bit from the game that I think is where they're conversating about uh, how girls used to be and you know, just seeing a little bit more of the past and um, just, I, it just showed a lot of Joel connecting with Ellie in some ways. And also, uh, Joel, or Peter Pascal, he looks really good at Joel here. I think he was a great casting for Joel uh, just because he looks so much like him. He seems so much like him as well. So I think that was great casting. Now on the other side of that, we have Ellie. Um, I don't think that this is, this is good casting. I mean, she could be really good in this role, but just by a couple of these clips here, she doesn't look like an Ellie to me. Uh, I think that maybe the, the girl from it would have been a good choice, uh, Beverly or maybe like Millie Bobby Brown or I uh, actually, uh, probably the best choice would have been the, the girl from stranger things, uh, Max, uh, especially with that final uh season four part uh i think she would have been a really good choice actually in this role but we'll see how this goes then of course we have more bonding it looks like between them and then also uh we have the guy from parks and rec uh nick and his last name is escaping me uh but i think he's a good addition to this show just because he looks like someone that has is, is <laughs> in a uh apocalypse uh, something like that. So I think he'd be, uh, he should be a good choice. Uh, hopefully they have him in a majority of this TV show. Hopefully he just doesn't get killed off five minutes into the show. So, and then we have this last part here, which I think is pretty cool is, uh, Ellie just shining a light on, I don't know, like, uh, spores or, you know, just this, last of us kind of infected part here but you can clearly see that there's a clicker right there so i mean the clicker rate in this clip looks really cool i don't think we've seen a, a clicker yet but uh i mean you can easily see the outline here but um with that all being said of this just 
first few looks at the TV show. Um, it looks like it should be pretty decent. Uh, the things I am a little bit worried about is that I hope it's not 100% the TV show to a game because, I mean, the, the game is very cinematic-like, so, I mean, we've already almost seen it like live action in some ways. Uh, I don't know if this is really the, the best thing to do with a video game to a TV show is having basically a ultra realistic looking video game be a live action just because what's what's the point for a gamer to play this or watch this um, and then the next thing is like I was talking about with Ellie I don't really think this is a the best casting for Ellie Joel I think is phenomenal but Ellie is very questionable and then the last thing I would say is that Neil Druckmann, of course, is one of the writers on this. Uh, and then he, there is another writer on the, this show as well. Hopefully, Neil Druckmann doesn't have 100% control of this TV show just because uh, we know the difference between The Last of Us Part 1 and The Last of Us Part 2, where he had different kinds of control in both those games. So hopefully, it's more like The Last of Us Part 1 <laughs> rather than The Last of Us Part 2. But... We'll, uh, we'll end up seeing with that as well. But, um, yeah, just let me know what you guys think. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Do you think these are uh, these uh, clips look really good? Uh, are you excited for it? Uh, let me know. Subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, we'll see you later. Bye.